Hey guys, Havasu Lou out in beautiful Lake Havasu. Hey, we're out here checking out this four bedroom pool home with a detached RV garage for a client. Hang out, check it out too, and I'll talk to you in a minute. All right guys, we're out here at 2633 Glengarry Drive, north side location. This one was just listed, 770. It's a four bedroom and it's actually being used as an Airbnb and it's pretty booked. So this was our opportunity to kind of get in. We were trying to get in for a few days over the weekend and it's getting booked again tomorrow. So we're here checking it out. There's a nice lake shot from down the street. So this sits on a pretty big lot, 12,500 square feet. There is a detached RV garage in the back of this one, and this does have a pool. So you have a lot of extra side paved parking with a extra wide RV boat access. You can see the garage in the back there. Has a tile roof. Nicely landscaped. Again, Airbnb and we can get the financials. Nice courtyard. All right guys, this is a four bedroom, three bath pool home built in 1996, 2019 square feet. Again, sits on a big 12,589 square foot lot. Has a nice big open living area. Plantation shutters throughout. This one does have a casita attached to the RV garage in the back. So the main house has three bedrooms, two baths, and then there's a one, one casita in the back. So you have a little dining area, slider out to the backyard pool area. Nice kitchen, all upgraded. Solid surface counters. Stainless appliances. The black stainless. Have a cool little pool view out the window. Skylight, can lights. So this is a split floor plan. So you have the master on one side and the guest bedrooms on the other, pretty typical Havasu setup. You have your indoor laundry, access to the garage, and your master on one side of the house. You have your walk-in closet. You have your master bath, looks like a granite top. Only one sink, a little small. All right, let's check out the other side of the house. So you have your guest bath, also has granite tops. You have guest bedroom number one at the front of the house. So you have guest bedroom number two, the rear of the house. The house is super clean. They have it really well dialed in for a Airbnb.
All right, let's go check out the garage and the pool and the rest of the outside. So you have your indoor laundry off the kitchen and living area. Looks like they have a little owner's lockout, stackables, and access to the garage. So you have your standard two-car garage that's 27 feet deep. Seven-foot door, it is insulated. 23 wide at the opening of the door. So the renters do get to occupy this space, but not the RV garage in the rear. All right, so you have your back patio. Looks like they extended it with a little Luma wood cover on both sides. You have your side parking and your RV garage. They have a little hose bib off of the uh, RV garage. Looks like there's cameras. Lots of side RV boat parking back here and it's pretty wide. So you have a cool little pool. It is a fiberglass pool, so it needs very little maintenance. Never have to replaster it or just kind of sits there like a boat hole in the ground. Looks like they have a little gas fire pit over here as well. Pool equipment is all behind the gate out of the sun. It does say it's on natural gas, but there's a propane tank, so I think that's an error. So you still have some room back here behind the casita and the uh, RV garage. So you have an outdoor shower, another Aluma wood patio cover, and then the casita. We'll go check that out. All right, so you have a real nice detached casita set up back here. So it has all the plank tile floors, surround sound. It's a pretty big space. So it has its own air conditioning unit. Nice uh, solid surface bar top. Little kitchen back here, no stove. So you have some extra linens, another owner lockout, and access to the RV garage, which unfortunately is an owner garage, and they do rent that out separately. So if you could do that as well if you were to buy it. Lots of under-counter storage. Of course, you could always rent this casita out separately too since it does have um, its own entry all right so you have your little bathroom solid surface counters little window out to the pool area nothing fancy but it's nice and clean has your shower also has tile floors Hey guys, Abbasi Lou back again with you. Hope you enjoyed the quick little video walk through the house over here on Glengarry. Again, this one is being used as a successful vacation rental. All the financials are available. Just reach out to me and I can send you what I have. Uh, also, the I forgot to mention the RV garage, even though it is being uh, rented out separately, is 48 feet deep with a 12 foot door, 23 and a half foot wide at the door opening. Um, anyway, I will put a direct link to the listing detail page right below this video so you can guys can get all the original listing pictures, current price, and availability. Of course, if you have any other questions, always feel free to reach out to me. All my contact information is right below this video. You guys have a great day, and I'll talk to you soon.